Good day, tubes. Hope everybody's doing fine today. Yesterday I went uh, garage selling. I buy things at garage sales and resell them on eBay. Went to a subdivision just north of Pinecraft. It's probably about uh, 25 blocks north of Pinecraft, two miles or more. There was, I would imagine, 30 different houses in this subdivision that had garage sales, community-wide garage sale. So I spotted these four ladies, Amish ladies, on three-wheelers. They had the baskets on the back full and running over. And I thought this might make an interesting video. Since they don't have any vehicles, the only way they can get around is uh, either to hire someone to drive them or to ride their bicycles. And so they're, they're uh, shopping there. Interesting story. Uh, I was in buying some things. I bought I buy a lot of vintage toys and there's a pair of sunglasses there marked one dollar. And an Amish gentleman was looking at them and uh, he asked him if he would take 50 cents. And the owner said no, he wants a dollar for it. So the Amish guy put the sunglasses down and didn't buy it. That just shows you how frugal the Amish are. They make every penny count. By riding their bicycles, they don't have to pay uh, for the gasoline, they don't have to pay insurance and maintenance on the car, oil, and tires, and all that. So it's a, an easy or inexpensive way to get around. And uh, the only problem is when it rains, it's sort of a problem, but uh, that's when they just get the umbrellas out and keep on going. So I hope you enjoy this little video. There's some more. Amish uh, going past a garage sale. Put just about anything you can imagine in the back of these uh, bicycles. Some of them have battery power and they can actually uh, run without pedaling. This fellow here, I'm not sure, don't think he's Amish. He don't have his hat on, so I uh, thought uh, he was an interesting looking character. And then also on the way back to Pinecraft, uh, which is the winter home of the Amish come from all over the country. This fellow here had been to the grocery store and had his supplies on the back of his three-wheeler. And also with the Pioneer Trails bus, they use a lot of golf carts and Yoders brought uh, several boxes of oranges over to the Pioneer Trails bus. So I hope you enjoy this little video, a little peek into the life and times of Pinecraft. Thanks for watching.